as Ireland kick off at Cardiff Arms Park. For the third time in four years, their hopes of winning the Triple Crown depend on beating Wales, who play with black numbers in white squares. Conditions are a little better than expected, and straight away, Wales are attacking. With barely a minute gone, a penalty is given against Ireland. New cap Ben Edwards of Newport takes the kick. It's over, and Wales lead by three points to nil. O'Meara gets it and passes to Kyle. Kyle to Henderson, and the Queen's man is away. He's tackled, but passes to Mackay. Mackay to Lane, who runs across field. He's tackled, but passes back to Mackay. Everybody's up there now. There's a bit of muddled play. Anything can happen. The Irish are fighting hard to equalize. The ball comes loose, and Ireland have it. It works out to Kyle. And he's touched down for Ireland, halfway between the flag and the goalpost. Miller takes the kick. He fails to convert, and it's three all. Resuming after the interval, Wales try desperately to regain the lead, and it's a hard, tough battle. The ground's cut up rather badly, and the ball's heavy and slippery. Now here's Kyle again. He passes to Henderson, but it comes to nothing. Ireland ought to be well ahead, really. They've missed several penalties. Those who feared Wales might crack, as they did against Scotland, are agreeably surprised. They're even pulling out a bit more than the Irish in the closing stages. Newcomer Cliff Morgan's played well. He passes to Jack Matthews, but Henderson's there to make things difficult. Ireland must win to keep the Triple Crown. It's a hectic few minutes, but with no more scoring, the game ends in a draw, 3-all, and there'll be no Triple Crown winner this season.